What up guys, it's see Mickey. Welcome back to my channel. So today, I know it's been a while since I've recorded a video. I've been so busy with work and me being sick and then being with my boyfriend. It's, it's a whole other story. But anyway, today I'm going to be doing a Try Not to Laugh challenge, as you guys love so much. Um, cutaway compilations from season 15, part 7, it says. So I am going to get this right. And I'm going to keep this stone cold as hard as I can. So I will keep it right. So stone cold. Let's get to it. We now return to Rational Geographic. Upon realizing a trip to Africa would be smelly and gross, our crew decided to stay in the office. Great job, Chris. Why don't you jerk the rest of the day off? Man, this is the best job ever. And to think I almost took that pop-up restaurant gig. Hi, you hungry? Ah, uh, how'd he get in my car? Great garlic knots, scary kid. Why don't you guys all come to my show tonight as my guests? Are you serious? Taylor Swift, that gross. stage with Taylor Swift? Well, that would be even sorry. cooler than when I was in that remake of The Princess Bride with Bill Cosby. Now, one of these has the Iocane powder, you see, and one of them makes you go sleepy by with your mouth open. Aw, oh, my nightmare dog is dead. Marley and me. Aw. Hi, I'm that prostitute you guys hired to seduce your friend. Oh, boy. Well, deal's off. He's dead. But perhaps we can make other arrangements. <laughs> Do you think I could try to kick one? No, you're all-time goalie. Damn it, this is awful. How could I have not noticed sooner? I mean, it's more obvious than when George Takei was in the closet. Hey, George, how are you? I am a heterosexual. I love vaginas. So what are you doing tonight? Hopefully choking on some lovely lady parts. Oh, numbers. All right, that sounds fun. See you later. I am a heterosexual. I've seen what happens when people hold in their aggression for too long. Don't forget, I was in that elevator with Jay-Z. Oh, no. Hey, did you have your guy hit two? I gotta get down to the business center to print out my boarding pass. Oh, hey, that's gonna leave a mark. <laughs> that's from a movie. So are you girls traveling with your dad here? Hey, don't kick him, muddy shoes. He's got a white suit on. Hey, look, I don't know if you guys are really staying here, but you can't get into the pool without a room key. Do you even realize the harm you've caused? Harm? What are you talking about? I'm making the world a better place. Like when I was the Instagram police. Sorry, lady, gotta crop the church. I will take this. And cut away complete. Sorry, Lois, I honestly thought this was gonna be fun. Like when I won that sex contest. Huh? First again. Wasn't even close, was it? No, Peter. It wasn't even close. Yeah, you are terrible at this. Now, why don't you clean up and go get the champ a Gatorade, huh? Awesome. Oh, we haven't done anything as a group since we went bird watching. Guys, look. It's the yellow headed puffin face. Ooh. It's a solitary creature. Its feathered crown is designed to scare away mates. It's known to swell its face to assert dominance when threatened. What does it eat, Peter? Gin and whatever's in the bowl at the airport bar. We now return to the Terminator. Oh, no. I've been sent here from the future. I have to have sex with your housekeeper to save humanity. What? Bring me your housekeeper. I have to have sex with her now. I'm the Terminator. I don't have a housekeeper, and I think you're just present-day Arnold Schwarzenegger. No, I am a machine. Every second I'm not having sex with a housekeeper. Robots are killing people in the future. Okay, I finished for the day. You lied to me. You do have a housekeeper. Let's go make a large-faced boy. Yeah, no offense, Peter, but I don't know if you should be running a school. What are you talking about? I'm a natural leader. That's why I'm so good at leading Simon Says. Simon Says, leave the band. Come on, Brian. You and I should probably rehearse. We've got a show in 20 minutes. Fine, go ahead. It's not gonna be the same. Like Cheers wasn't the same when they brought in Kirstie Alley. Norm! No, I'm... I'm Rebecca. Oh, oh my God! God. Get to the dogs, we we it. Uh oh. This means I have an awkward phone call to make. 
What? No, no, it was stupid. What, two guys going to homecoming? I, I assumed it was a goof this whole time. Take it out. I'm ugly and unlovable. Oh. All right, you guys ready for church? Church? What are you, an idiot? It's the first snow of the season. We're going sledding. Please, can we, Mom? Well, I mean, it's Sunday, and... Come on, Lois. After all, sledding was the second passion of the Christ. Eat this, for this is my dust. Brian, please. If you do this for me, you'll be a hero. Just like King Arthur when he pulled the sword from the stone. Oh, yeah. Whew. Oh, God, this is embarrassing. I'm so sorry. It's been like 500 years. Ah, this is your big moment, and I'm ruining it. Damn it. I can't believe I missed it. Jeez, I hope I don't end up stuck in here like Winnie the Pooh. Oh, Rabbit, perhaps you should push with your shoulder and not your fist. Don't worry about it. I don't know. I've never played baseball before. Ah, oh, come on, Chris. You gotta do it. If you don't, you'll regret it. Just like Jesus' friend, Evan, who bailed on the Last Supper. Mm. Aw, they did a painting? I would have gone if I knew they were going to do a painting. Wow, this place is cool. Yeah, what do all these buttons do? Like, what's this red one? Well, that's a voice filter, so the passengers always think the pilot is a 60-year-old Midwestern white man. What? That's impossible. Hi, y'all. This is Cleveland. Good afternoon, folks. This is Captain Dale Clark up here on the flight deck. We're way up in the air. We've reached our cruising altitude of 37,000 feet. Y'all get ready to watch Big Mama's house. Our in-flight entertainment today will be Under the Tuscan Sun. Oh, I like that. I hear it's good. What? Oh, damn it, being deaf sucks. I'd rather be stuck on a Disney cruise. <laughs> oh, 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 don't eat the shrimp. Oh, oh. I mean, it's a tough decision. Like what to do with that big watermelon I bought. Griffin, I just wanted to tell you, that's a great outfit. Keep it up. I knew it. I have to start trusting myself more. Wow, Dad, I guess that means Grandpa's your new boss. Ah, oh, crap. I don't want to work for him. I'd rather work for Dr. Frankenstein. Oh. Igor, I did it! Hold on. You discovered the power to create new life, and you created a guy? So, I should have made a woman so I could have sex with a corpse? I don't know, man. You just shouldn't have made a guy. Man, you guys think Joe's as happy as he says he is just doing all that desk work? No way. He's just putting lipstick on a pig. This is called Crimson Sky. What do you think? Mmm. Harold? Get this off of me! What are you doing in the women's department? Uh, waiting for you? Well, I'm ready. Let's go. Who are you? Peter, I need you to take Chris and Meg to school. Today's the day I finally kill that squirrel that's been eating our tomatoes. Try to get like eight of them this time. I want to make bruschetta. You know, I have a good feeling about this, Brian. After all, you certainly can't be any worse than the last roommate I had. What the? Please don't cry. She's already very angry at me. Peter, where are you? You will wash your hands after you poop. Oh, oh! I can't believe it, you guys. This is the biggest surprise Ooh. since the last M. Night Shyamalan movie. Oh, Two no. tickets for the M. Night Shyamalan movie? Wow. Really? And you, you're done. Clean out your locker. Kicked out? I'm totally screwed. Like those poor guys who had to come up with a new ad campaign for Subway. Hey, I'm Mike. I like sandwiches and people my own age. Subway, please don't think of pedophilia. Griffin, what are you doing here? I... I work here. You do? No way! Oh, this is gonna be fun. Effective immediately, you're the guy at the office with a weird ski tan, but you can't talk about it. Hey, what, you go skiing this weekend? I'm not allowed to talk about it. Yeah, I mean, are you really happy in here? You bet I am. I'm happier than a squash on Halloween. Dad, are they coming to take us away too? No, son, we're fine. How about on Thanksgiving? You know what, just enjoy the month. <laughs> yes, you heard me right. Cancel my insurance. I've been in this location for 40 years and never once have I broken a lamp. Good day, sir.
God, I hope he's got insurance. Of course he's got insurance. He's been at this location for 40 years. <laughs> yes, you heard me right. Cancel my husband's life insurance. He's been in perfect health for 40 years. We're selling the lamp store and going to travel. We need this after losing both our children. Good day, sir. Well, that's a... Uh... Ooh, I'm glad I didn't laugh. <laughs> Okay, no, no, no. The video's ending. The video's ended. Okay. Whew. But <laughs> that was my victory. I finally won for kind of my compilations from season 15, part seven. Um, yeah. Uh, I hope you guys would request more videos for me to do because I'm such a family guy. Um, but let me know what you guys think of the video in the comments below. Like the video and don't forget to subscribe. Later, guys.